Well, as we move further through the 21st century, elections around the world are having more of a role and more of an impact online. And here in the Cube, we want to see what information we could glean from big tech giants like Google and Facebook and the unique perspective that they could provide on this 2020 United States presidential election. Let's start with Google Trends and by looking at what people have been searching for online, this can give us an idea of what subjects matter most to US citizens in the lead up to this election. And when you compare the picture to previous electoral years, you'll notice a stark difference. Let's take the phrase postal voting that received a huge amount of interest in 2020 noticed by this red line here compared to previous electoral years a surge interest increase of more than 362 percent it was a similar story for phrases like electoral fraud and fact checking a lot of information has been circulating online in the lead up to this election about mail-in ballots that of course dates back to the tweets by the united states president donald trump who here back in may suggested that mail-in ballots could lead to a fraudulent election something that was famously labelled by Twitter. Other issues like unemployment and the health crisis as a result of COVID-19 are also high on the list. So those are the key issues, but how have politicians acted upon this and how have candidates in the United States spent the most money online, particularly when it comes to adverts on Facebook? Well, we compared the Democrats to the Republicans and it is Joe Biden and his campaign that have spent the most amount of money. In the last week alone, it is 9.28 million US dollars on adverts from his dedicated campaign pages. That's more than double that of Donald Trump at 4.47 million US dollars. And it's a similar story for the vice presidential candidates with Kamala Harris more than double that of Mike Pence. So that's the contrast and the difference between the two parties. But where exactly are they spending this money and what states are important to them? Well, over the last month, we looked at those crucial states where the most advertising money has been spent on Facebook. And it's a similar story. You have key swing states like of North Carolina, Michigan and Pennsylvania. And unsurprisingly, perhaps here at the top, Florida, that crucial state where it's predicted there will only be a few points between the Democrats and the Republicans. Joe Biden spending six million in the last month on Facebook adverts in Florida and Donald Trump four million. And when you go back to the subjects that these adverts are about, you'll notice that they focus on those trends that people were searching for on Google. Donald Trump, for example, in this advert in Florida, focusing on the COVID-19 pandemic, urging people to join him together in the country and fight and defeat the coronavirus. Meanwhile, Joe Biden in states like Pennsylvania has focused on different issues, the likes of unemployment and social injustice and racism in the United States. But he also has a clear message in his political adverts, such as this one here, which says we have to get this guy out of there. A clear message there from the Democrats in Facebook adverts that they are against their Republican rival, Donald Trump. So there you have key data from both Google and Facebook, giving us a unique insight into what people are searching for ahead of this election and how much online advertising candidates are spending their money on. 